Welcome to Red Dead 2, and thanks for joining us. Today we are going to learn how to craft the legendary Ram Rifleman Gloves. You're going to need 12 bucks, a legendary Ram Hide, and of course a perfect boar pelt. So let's take a look at how you get these. First of all, let's start off with where to find the perfect war pelt. And uh, for this, we are south of Rhodes, south of Braitwaite Manor along the river. Here we find one with three stars. We're going to go ahead and activate Dead Eye there by pushing an R3. We're going to tag it with R1 and then, of course, shoot with R2. And keep our fingers crossed that we got a good shot at. Now, you can also find this west of Strawberry and uh, north of uh, Saint-Denis if you're looking for a perfect three-star wild boar. Now, as we go up to scan the thing by holding down the triangle button, one of the questions that some of you may have is, what weapon should I use? And the short answer to that question is the Springfield Rifle. You could also get away with arrows, but it's a little tough unless you're using improved arrows to get that uh, good shot in. One other thing I would highly recommend doing, and that is save your game just in case something happens. That way you do not have to repeat this whole process again. Now let's shift our focus to getting that legendary ram hide. And uh, for that, we are going to a place called Cat Tail Pond. And you're going to ask, where is Cat Tail Pond? Well, it's technically just uh, northwest of Valentine, mostly west of Valentine, and north of the Wallace Station. Well, a little bit northeast, but mostly north of the Wallace Station. There's uh, two different paths you can take to get there. And as you can see, uh, we are looking for three clues. The first clue, of course, is the hardest one to find. And that is this question mark that is on the uh, compass on the, the left of uh, Mr. Marston here. So here we are. We're going to go ahead and search for that first clue. Okay, uh, we're right there. We're going to hold down the triangle button. And there we have it. We have clue number one. Now we are going to uh, start using the tracking feature which can be activated by pushing in both the L3 and R3 buttons. That's the right analog stick and left analog stick. Push them in as a button at the same time. This is really cool for, you know, tracking any type of animal, especially the legendary ones. We're going to be looking for a gold. Uh, let's see if we see some gold there. We're, go we're going to follow the trail till we find the gold there. So we get to that second clue, and we're going to do the same thing uh, with the third clue as well. Another question many of you may have is, what weapon should I use here? And the answer is, you can pretty much choose whatever you want, as the pelt quality does not matter when you're hunting legendary animals. Although, one side note, I used dynamite arrows one time on a different one of these legendary animals and I was not able to skin the thing so but otherwise you should be able to use any high-powered weapon here we're using a repeating shotgun and uh, going for that next clue there as you can see uh, highlighted in gold now of course once you find that third clue again you're gonna search using the triangle button you're gonna want to have your weapon ready to uh, go after this thing because after you get the third clue you're going for the animal next so okay we got the third clue now we're going to want to use the tracking feature again and uh, we can see forward right there and uh, lo and behold there is the legendary bighorn ram now all we need to do is use dead eye here fire a couple shots we got a repeating shotgun here and uh, that should be enough to take it down just in case that sequence was a little too fast, I've attached a slow motion replay on the left. Again, you're just looking to get a lot of powerful shots in so you can bring this legendary animal down. Now the next thing we're going to do is go ahead and skin this thing by holding down the triangle button. 
and uh, that should take a little while. But uh, you want to get both of these uh, spots here. You want to grab the part you're skinning, of course, and get the animal as well, so you can get full value from a trapper. And, of course, there are five different trapper locations you can go to. Which one you choose, of course, is up to you. For this one, we are going to head to the trapper near uh, Tall Trees. So let's go ahead and head over there. Okay, you found your nearest trapper. And I assume you know how to sell to this guy. We're going to look at where you need to go to buy. Uh, what you're going to do is hold down L2. Hold down the triangle for buy. We're hitting X for garment sets. And we're going to scroll down to item number 7, the soccer. And we're going all the way down to the bottom where it says legendary ram rifleman gloves. We've got all the necessary ingredients. All we need to do is hit X to craft. And uh, there we have it. We have crafted it. Now we can just back out uh, with the circle button. And uh, yeah, now we have the gloves. So that is going to uh, wrap this up. I am signing out. I would like to uh, thank you for watching and uh, wish you good luck.